baby. Oh, my babies. Hey guys, I hope you're having an awesome day. A um, lot of mosquitoes out. A, uh, a thoughts I'm having, some thoughts I'm having. I wanted to share it with you. Hopefully it helps anyone that either you or anyone that you know. Uh, right now we are uh, greatly very much in the process of finding another location. Uh, I love Estacada. I love it here so much. There's a, a big part of me that is so sad to leave, but also there's that big part of me that knows it, it, it has to happen. Like I've come to terms with it. I accepted it and it has to happen. But as I make this decision and as I'm searching, which I think I have found the, the, the property and I can't wait to share it with you if it, if it happens. But as we're searching and as I'm going through all of this, it's, uh, it is rather stressful, but also I can't um, help but think about the pain. For some reason, I'm, I'm really thinking about the pain, the, the, the immense, immense pain, emotionally and physically, emotionally and physically uh, of, of what I've had to go through in order to get here and not just me and the people on my team included like Sonia has a terrible back. Um, and of course, emotionally, we're, we're up and down with so many different things as far as losing animals and, and certain changes that we have to adapt to all these things, right? Just like you, it's, it's really no different. We all have to adapt to change and go through it. But the pain that it takes and I want I, I say this because I know that a lot of you are experiencing pain in many different ways. And the, 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 the aftermath of pain, the light from pain is, is more beautiful to me, in my opinion, than any other light that there is. The, the... Loba, Clyde, Loba, please. In the middle of a video, guys. Um, you know, I was just having this conversation with someone. It's like, it's, it's interesting. Life is so funny. Life is so funny that the greatest lessons that we learn are the hardest ones and and the the best victories are the ones that were so worth fighting for and, and getting through it's that pain that you're experiencing right now that's going to do more good for you than anything else in your life and if you remember that if that becomes like a positive trigger for you if you remember when you feel pain that this, this is what it takes, this is what you need to have the breakthroughs that you want to have. This is what you need to be able to comfort someone who's going through it. That pain is a gift. I know it sounds crazy and some people say, you don't know what I've been through. And, I, and it's like, yeah, I know I don't know what you guys have been through, but I know that as humans, we've all been through so much and have experienced so much pain that the ones that make it out are the ones that know truly in their hearts that that pain is going to lead to greatness, to true greatness. And the other side, people let that pain, and this is the biggest mistake that I ask you not to do and don't let anyone that you love or even that you don't like do this. The people that let pain turn them into a victim. Why me? Why me? and they start turning that into negativity. And, and that's when they're nasty to people because they're nasty to themselves. But the greatness, the, the, those of you who can turn that pain into greatness, you know, just because you see someone happy or, or chasing their dreams or anything like that, don't think that, you know, they must have always had it. It's the fact that they were able to get through it. And that's what I want you to remember. That's what I want you to share. When you get through that pain, when you get through it and you start realizing that it's a gift, the breakthroughs that you're gonna have, your ability to connect with people emotionally, spiritually, your ability to be more empathetic, more compassionate, that pain does that for you. So remember, it's a gift and so are you. I love you guys. Thanks for listening, thanks for watching. Share it with anyone you think could use it. Hold it on for yourself if you feel like it's, it's better for you. Whatever you want. I love you. Thanks so much for being here. Bye. Come on, guys.